A little update on the rest of my October 8, 2021. Got all my undercarriage sanded, um, masked everything off, and then I sealed it, sprayed my base coat, and my clear coat. So the undercarriage is done. I think it turned out pretty good. A lot of little nooks and crannies to go around. A lot of sanding, cleaning, spraying, um, spraying the clear coat. It laid it laid down really, really nice. Considering all the little nooks and crannies that you got to go around, so I'm I'm very happy with it. It's smooth. It's not perfect, but it's really pretty pretty doggone close so anyway there you go that's the undercarriage wheel wells are all sprayed just a lot of a lot of little spots back in there to get but turned out really nice Covered the whole car to keep the overspray down. Did my engine bay. It's all ready to go. Most of that's going to get covered with the panels, but firewall will be, you'll be able to see that with the motor in there, part of it anyway. So it turned out really nice. Next step, strip all the plastic off, um, get rid of my masking tape and so forth. I'll pull the car back out into this other shop. And I'll wet sand the body with 600 grit and then I'll spray it. If everything goes good, maybe next weekend I'll be spraying that body. No, oh, that's, that's a little aggressive. Maybe not. <laughs> I'll see once. But anyway, there you go. The bottom's done, and I think that's going to look really good. That is pure black. There's no other color in it, just pure black, jet black. So I think we get a little chrome on there, the stainless polished out. Might put a small red stripe, rocker stripe on. I haven't decided yet. That's the update for this week. Thanks for watching.